Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that works or not. <laughs> Where are you? Where are you? I know. Things. It's the little things, isn't it? <laughs> Guys, happy Saturday morning to you. It's bright and beautiful down in Kent. I hope it is wherever you are you as could, well. You could actually sunbathe now. I've just, I've just been out quickly. I burnt again yesterday in the garden. I'm getting a little bit of a tan. I'll never learn. I'll never learn. But fitties, we are here starting the day right Saturday morning. Bit of a lie-in for everyone. Um, and it's kettlebells. Kettlebells, body weight. You can use a dumbbell for this as well. There's always a, an alternative, if you will. You need but, a towel as well. Yeah, you will also need a, a hardback book, a big one. Hugh, Hugh's helping us out again this morning. Great book, this. Bit of free promo there, Hugh. <laughs> so, oh, Mine's sorry. better, but I've got Willie's chocolate Bible, of course. <laughs> chocolate recipes. So, preferably a, a thick, a large hardback book and a towel, kind of like a medium sized towel. You know, don't need a beach towel or anything like that, but you will need one of these. It's not a big deal if you don't, but it would be great if you could. Go get one now, go on, go and grab your hardback book, go and grab a towel. Make sure you've got some water because it's going to get sweaty as well. Give me a thumbs up so I know that you're, you've got the bits and bobs that are required for this workout. Who have we got? Morning Catherine, morning, morning Gemma. Gemma. Morning Catherine. Morning Instagram peeps. Right, Ready? thumbs up, we're seeing thumbs up so let's get into it. Lovely. Right. I don't want to ruin my book though. <laughs> Thing is, she's never used it. I am, I'm such a lie. She's been there catching dust. I read it, I didn't make that much yeah, of it. You've looked at pictures. It's a bit complicated. You're like, oh, that looks nice. Right, guys, so we'll start with a, a nice warm up. We're going to need it today because we're going to be working very, very hard. So just start off good old fashioned squats. Feet just wider than shoulder width, toes angled out, and just sink down into the squat. Nice and fluid movement, nice and relaxed. Sink as low as you can without the heels coming off the floor and then fully extend the knees, fully extend the hips at the top of the movement. So working through that nice big range. We'll do two more. Good, now take the feet wider. And what you're gonna do here Take like a bit of a sumo squat stance. You're first gonna start with some hip hinges in this position. So Keris will go side on. So you can see from here, just hinge over at the hips as much as you can, whilst keeping the back nice and straight. Lots of movement at the hips here, guys. Slight bend of the knee, feeling the lower back open up. Hamstrings, back of the upper legs there. And the glutes. Really trying to keep that back nice and straight though. Letting the hips do the work. Again, fully extending the hips at the top. Good, we'll do a couple more. Good, now keeping your feet where they are, you are just gonna go down into an actual sumo squat now. So again, working through as big a range as you can keeping those knees tracking outwards with the toes, trying not to let them bow in, fully extending the hips at the top, firing up those glutes, waking them up a little bit. Good, we'll do two more, starting now. One, two, nice. Right, get yourself into like a half kneeling position. And what you're gonna do here, you're just gonna support your body weight by putting the opposite hand to the leg that's forward on the floor. Now what I want you to do here is almost imagine you're pushing your knee over your toe as far as you can without the heel coming off the floor. So push and then ease off. Push and then ease off. So almost using your body weight to kind of lean on that front leg and as soon as you feel that heel starting to come off, stop there and just bring it back. And as you warm up a little bit, you should go, you have to go a little bit further each time. 
working that knee right over the toe. Really get in there, guys. Don't just kind of like go through the motions. Now we're going to take it a bit further. So now you kind of just bring the heel off and then back. Push forward, bring the heel off. Back, just working through as big a range of movement as you can. Now obviously you'll go further now that the heel can come off the floor. One more. Good. We'll do the same on the other side, guys. So get that half kneel again. And then just assist in that movement. But we're not spending too long at the top. We feel the stretch, we ease off. Through the stretch, ease off. It's just trying to mobilize the ankles a little bit because there's going to be a good bit of squatting today. And of course, we need to try and make sure we're not too restricted at the ankles there. Because essentially, you know, if you're tight at the ankles, it's going to affect your whole squat. Good. Do one more. And then we do go into the heel off now, pushing that a little bit further. Sometimes I completely forget what, where we are, what we're doing. Do you? Just completely zone out. <laughs> it's just like planning lunch. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm glad. Uh, <laughs> I'm glad you find my work like, so interesting. Get back in the room. Get back in the room. Back in the zone. <laughs> Good. Right, that do you guys? Right, stand up. Now, now we've mobilised the ankles a little bit. Just come up onto the toes and back down. So almost come down, rock up, back onto the heels a little bit and then push up onto the balls of the feet. Try and get as much height as we can. So when we're kind of coming up onto the balls of the feet there, go as high as you can. Just do a couple more. Good. Now for the shoulders guys, get these warm. Nice big circles. Yeah, keep a nice straight arm. Work for a bigger range as you can. Nice gentle warm up today. Sorry, I'm watching the chandelier today. Yes. After yesterday. <laughs> Good, so always leading with that thumb, come round and then twist as you come over. Trying to keep that arm as close to that kind of centre line as you can. For some reason, I, I, I told you this, I, I, I even put my hand on my stomach or I grab my chest when I do this, I don't know why. So Church weird. The games. The gains are intact. <laughs> and on the other side, guys. Call your left shoulder, honestly. I know, crunch, crunch. Hilarious. Hilarious. <laughs> big, big range, guys. Do a couple more. Good. Right, grab your kettlebell. This is still just a little quick warm up because today is gonna be pretty full on. So I just wanna make sure that your muscles are well prepared, okay? Stop putting everybody up. No, they love it, they love they it. The people love it. They do. <laughs> right. This is gonna be really hard. But it is, but I know you guys can do it, I believe. <laughs> right guys, deadlifts, just to wake up the hamstrings and the glutes and the back muscles as well. Feet in between, oh, sorry, kettlebell in between the feet even. And then from here, hinging back, nice straight back, grab a hold of your kettlebell or a dumbbell. And from here, drive up, fully extend the hips, fully extend the knees. We're gonna go for 15 reps here, guys. Yes, so do these with us. Down to the floor, extend. Nice big hip hinge, guys. We liven up the glutes now. Good, we go for seven more. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good stuff. Into 15 body weight squats. Let's go, you can do them on your count. Five, 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 ten, <laughs> nine, eight, seven, six, 
five, four, three, two, one. Good. Back to deadlifts, guys. Ten reps. Let's go. Five more. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Ten squats. Let's go. Five more. Three, two, one. One, one more set, guys. Five of each. Is still a warm up. <laughs> <laughs> Just really focusing on quality movement here, guys. Firing up the right muscles. Good. And then five squats. Set a jump. Two, three. Four, five, da -da. Cool. Well, I'm warm. Oh. Good stuff, guys. Have a little shake out. Yes, please. Right, let's get into this. Okay, we're <laughs> going to kick off with a Tabata drill. Oh. Or a Happy Willie. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, so about a format is 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds rest, 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds rest. Normally it lasts four minutes. Today we're gonna to use the format just for five minutes. Maybe we'll extend it. We'll see how we're feeling. We'll go with the flow, but five is the minimum. And it's we're good. more easy lifting, sorry. Sit. Do we do more? But maybe yeah. five. Huh? Let's do more. Let's do more. Yeah. You might change your mind. Okay. So two exercises, you're gonna alternate every set for the 20 seconds of work. Exercise number one, good old swings. So, come a bit side on. That's it. Ready? Yeah, bring your feet a bit closer. Good, so start with the kettlebell out in front. Nice hip hinge here, straight back. From here, Kara's gonna hike back, taking the wrist to the inside of the legs, loading up the hamstrings and the glutes, and then powering through the hips Propelling the arms and the kettlebell off of the hips, so not trying to muscle it with the upper body. Full hip extension, squeezing the glutes for dear life. Full knee extension, do these with us guys so you're warm, you know what's coming. Aim for that chest or face height with a kettlebell. As you come down, just guiding that weight back, wrists to the inside of the leg, keeping it nice and central. Good, I was gonna say, keep going, keep going. <laughs> So you can go for 20 seconds there, guys. Nice, ex nice explosive repetitions. You then get 10 seconds rest. You then go into a heels elevated goblet squat. So this is what we need the book for. But it's gonna be a slightly narrow stance. Yeah, so get your heels so they're kind of just on the, co uh, the corners of the book. Angle your toes out just a little bit. Now the full version is to do it with a weight. Yeah, so from here, still keeping that weight through the heels, but because we've elevated the heels, it's going to emphasize the quads at the front of the legs here more. Because it it's going to allow it for, <laughs> yeah, I can confirm, <laughs> that is correct. Oh. So it's going to create much more knee flexion. More knee flexion means more quads. But you've also got the added benefit now of being able to go uh, a little bit lower with a more upright back because we've got the heel elevation and the counterbalance of the weight. So take advantage of that, keep the back nice and straight and keep that weight through the heels, down, fully extend the knees, fully extend the hips at the top of the movement. If, or, uh, if you can't go that narrow, you can use two books, can you? Yeah, if you can't go narrow, feel free to use two books that are pretty much the same height. Of course, you can ditch the weight entirely and just do them with body weight, just have your arms, arms, <laughs> your arms out in front, and just work through that added range of movement there. I'd probably suggest starting with this if you've not done these before, um, and then you can build up once you've like, you, you feel comfortable doing them and you feel like uh, you can add a little bit of load. Or of course, if you're just not quite there yet on the mobility front, or your knees don't like it very much, just do the regular bodyweight squats or goblet squats, yeah? Nice and simple guys, 20 seconds of swings, 
20 sec uh, 10 seconds rest, 20 seconds of the heels elevated goblet squats, and we repeat, we go for five minutes, so that's five sets on each thing. Kevish is going big today with a 20 fold. Do you want uh, Forcing me to go heavier, I like it. Are you gonna squat with that or do you want mine? Uh, we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> right guys, get your book on the ready. You've got 10 seconds to switch it up anyway. Let us know what book you're using. Yeah, that give us. Is it a good one? <laughs> yeah. Right guys, 20 seconds at the best. Let's be having you in three, two, one. Let's go. Load up hamstrings, load up glutes, big power through the hips. My inner thighs hurting from yesterday, yours. You what? My inner thighs from those Cossack squats from yesterday. In three, <laughs> two, one. Good. Ten second rest, guys. He was elevated. Remember, any version you like. Three, two, one. Let's go. Ooh. If you feel quite comfortable with this, try and find a bit of a rhythm, a bit of a pace. Oh, yeah. Five seconds. You've got to make it faster. <laughs> Three, two, one. One down, four to go. <sighs> Three, two, one. This is only a warm up drill, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> is this because you ate M&M's again? Yes. <laughs> 10 more seconds, seconds guys. So we're using the swings to liven up hamstrings and glutes. Squats for the quads. Three, two, one. Good. See if I can do it without moving. <laughs> Three, two, one. Let's go. Ah. Get that back nice and straight. Guys. Eight seconds. Three, two, one. Need to move the clock. Twisting awkward. My quads are gonna hate me. Oh, two down. Three, two, one. Let's go. Ten more seconds. Five, four, three, <laughs> two, one. Good. Three, no rest, two, <laughs> one. We work through that range, guys. Take advantage of the hill elevation. Get low, back nice and straight. On guys, 10. <sighs> Don't miss about three, <laughs> two, <laughs> one. No, I didn't actually finish my sentence. <laughs> three, two, one. Two more rounds, guys. Are we extending it? No. Only <laughs> <laughs> because of time, you know. Uh, yeah, what, Not because I'm knackered. Ten anything. seconds. Five seconds, guys. Three, two, one. Might try heavier. Okay, yo. Three, two, one. Let's go. Oh my god. <laughs> Don't mess at the top. As soon as you fully extended the hips, and straight in. Find a rhythm. Eight seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Whoa. Nice. One more set, guys. One on mouth. Oh, let's go. <laughs> Ten seconds. Come on, man. Nice hip extension, guys. Three, two, one. Oh, 
Last set yeah. on your squats now, guys. Many as you can. Three, two, one. Let's go. Even though we're emphasizing the quads a bit more, keep those glutes working. Big squeeze. Eight seconds. Oh. Keep going. Three, two, oh. one. Nice. Oh, good work. Nice work, guys. Oh. Definitely warm now. Yep. Okay. We no longer need the book. <laughs> so, maybe we can lunch. Except for what? Making lunch. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, have a little drink. Where's the water? I'll get you one. Good work. Okay, let's, let's liven this up a little bit. Now, what I want you to do, if you guys have done uh, quite a few of these workouts with us now, using kettlebells and assuming you've got the equipment to do so, I want you to try and push yourself today by going a little bit heavier, if you can. Definitely tell you about m Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm full of peanut m <laughs> Yeah, so go heavier, test yourself. Worst case scenario, it's too heavy, just drop it back down. But give it a go. Have a bit of faith in yourself, have a bit of confidence. You've been working hard. Let's start pushing it, pushing our boundaries a little bit. But equally, don't go hurting yourself now. So listen to your body. Don't just stick to a heavy weight because I've said it. I'm just here to try and urge you on, egg you on a little bit. So if you've got a heavier bell or a dumbbell, grab it. Let's give it a go. Right, next drill guys. Five exercises, 45 seconds of work on each. 15 seconds of rest in between each one. Three rounds, 15 minutes of graph right now. Now we're gonna start off with a bit of a combo exercise. So you guys have done RDLs, single leg RDLs, Romanian deadlifts with us, and you've done step back lunges. We're gonna combine the two. So holding the kettlebell in the opposite hand to the leg that's forward, you're then gonna come up onto one foot, Big, big hip hinge, slight bend of the knee, push the bum back, hinge over till you get that nice stretch in the hamstring and the glutes. Keep that weight through the heel, extend the hip. Once you've done one rep, you forget in there. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, you're gonna step, step back into a lunge, get as low as you can, and then power it forward. Keris is gonna do a nice couple of reps now with each. So it's an RDL, step back lunge. Can you put your foot down at the top or not? Yeah, you can. If you, yeah, <laughs> good. But do two real time reps okay. now, so people get the idea. So we hinge, load up hammies and glutes, back, hinge, oh, balance. back, yeah. So if you need to lightly put the foot down, that's absolutely fine, yeah? How are you going with me to do it? No, no, I'm just I'm waiting for you to. Okay. Put the kettle down. <laughs> yeah, so just keep that sequence going. RDL, Romanian deadlift, step back lunge. Keep repeating, find a rhythm, keep going for the 45 seconds. Then, to give the legs and the lower back a little bit of a rest, we're gonna do some upper body work. Push-ups. So we're gonna do one side? One side, yeah. And then we'll come back to the other side. Right guys, we're gonna do a one and a half push-up. So what you're gonna do here, we'll show you the full version first of all. High plank, tuck the pelvis, squeeze the glutes, crunch the abs. From here, lower yourself as low as you possibly can to the floor. You then come back up halfway, go back down, and then come up all the way. Evil. Wallop. Go again, all the way down, low as you can, up halfway, keeping that tension, back down, and then we power up. Bosh. <laughs> Progression. <laughs> Knee on the floor, or knees on the floor. Same scenario, all the way down, up halfway, down, and we power back up. If you can't get that low, don't worry about it. Work with the range that you've got. But even so, if you come to say here at the bottom, just come up a fraction, go back down, and then come all the way up. Work with the range that you've got, 
but that's just kind of keeping that time under tension on the muscle that little bit longer so it gets a little bit tasty that but the good news is your legs have now recovered so you then do the other side RDL step back lunge RDL step back lunge then you're going to do I'll demo this one yeah. an alternating row so one kettlebell hinge over at the hips keep it just in front of the body ever so slightly and from here you're going to really power that kettlebell up so drive that elbow up and back not bunching the shoulder so up and back towards the hip from here power back down change power back down so don't be slow about it really drive that elbow up yeah keep the core nice and strong abs glutes always working looking after that lower back power up so really lift it like you mean it go for some nice solid power element of control on the way down though look after your flooring then last thing working on the core and a little bit of the upper body we're just going to do a plank walk out so in a high plank position tuck the pelvis crunch the abs squeeze the glutes so here's rock solid feet about shoulder width now from here in just two steps Kerry's going to take one arm out then the other one so that's obviously going to increase the tension here then we come back in two steps so working with the range you've got we know Keris has got a crazy strong core so if she wants to be really reaching as far as you can come back so reach as far as you can there Whoa. and then back there there trying to alternate the arm that you leave with each time of course regression on that is reduce how far you reach just a very subtle still going to be testing that core regression further still knees on the floor and then you can reach out test the core that way as well or if you wish to you can just hold the plank position either on your knees or in high plank choice is yours bish bash bosh that's one round done 15 seconds rest we go back to our rdl and step back lunge combination righty let's do it what weight are you going for Kerry? 16 16 yeah cool sorry i'll go for a 28 I've told them to go heavier, it's only what I do, isn't it? Hey. Someone did message the other day and said, it's so good that you guys suffer with us. <laughs> <laughs> it's true, we're in this together, guys, we're a team. Right, guys, let's do it. RDL, step back lunge combo. 45 seconds of work. You all right? In three, two, one, let's go. So, fully extend step back find that rhythm on the wrong side. Huh? On the right side. here's obviously that added challenge if you don't put your foot down at the top just keep that back nice and straight guys we've got 20 seconds to go nice big hip hinge you don't have to hinge so that the kettlebell or the dumbbell comes all the way down to the floor. You just got to hinge ah. enough until you feel it, hamstrings, glutes. Five seconds. Five seconds. Ah. And break. Ooh, hello glutes. <laughs> it's nice, because again, it's tough, but it's, nice it's to not ooh, ooh, tough. Right, three, two, one. One and a half push-ups, guys, any version. All the way down, up halfway, down and up. Yeah, these are horrible. Work with the range you've got, guys. Oh. Regress it however you need to. I used these actually when I was recovering from my shoulder dislocation to work my chest and shoulders without loading up too much. How are you talking as you do this? Uh, it's the first round. I'll, I'll go to pieces after this round. <laughs> 10 more seconds, guys. Three, two, one. Good. I forget. They're horrible. Other leg, guys. Oh, I do. In three, <laughs> two, gross. one. Let's go. Big hip hinge, load up hamstrings and glutes. Step back. 
trying to keep those hips nice and flat to the floor. Really emphasize that hip hinge. Push the bum back as far as you can. Load up hamstrings, glutes. And remember, just go as low as you need to, to feel that stretch. It's so good for your balance as well. 15 seconds. Yeah. Keep the hips parallel to the floor. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, she's falling over. Walk, five seconds. And right, rest, rest, rest. <laughs> Cool. Alternating rows now, guys. Really focus on that power. Driving that weight up. Three, two, one, drive. If you're using a dumbbell, you've obviously got a little bit further to go <laughs> to pick it up. So you can either put something under the dumbbell, so it's a little bit higher, or you could just do one arm and change halfway, which would be now. 20 to go, guys. Keep the core strong. Keep the back strong. 10 more seconds. Really power that elbow up. Keep your hand on me, Lee. Three, two, one. Good stuff guys. 10 seconds, plank walkouts. Five, four, three, two, one. Tuck the pelvis, crunch the abs, squeeze the glutes. Reach, minimal movement of the hips. Do it in two steps. So reach one, two, back, one, two. 20 gone. Reach as far as you can. Always tucking that pelvis though. Always crunching the abs, squeezing the glutes. It's gonna look after your lower back. Just work in the range that you've got though. No point pushing it. Come on guys, last five seconds. Five seconds. Squeeze the glutes and break. Wallop. Oh. Good work guys, round one done. Finito. Dorito. In five. Back to the ideal lunge combo. Three, two, one. Let's go. Big hip hinge. Step back. To be fair, even this without weight. It's good. It's good. 20 gone. I need to move this. I keep losing my balance. <laughs> 15 to go, guys. Oh, it's not too hard else then. Focus. 10 seconds. Oh, I lost five. Oh my gosh. Luke. Three, two, one. Oh. Oh man, so you know you're doing it right though. If the groups are going, ah. <laughs> These are the worst by far. Really? Yeah. Well, the push ups. Push -ups. Three, Horrors. two, one. Let's go. Up halfway, down. So, as low as you can, up halfway, down. Full range. Oh god. 15 gone. <laughs> Why would you do these? Why would you do a two minute plank? Oh! You're making them look so easy. <laughs> you make planking look so easy. Oh, I don't. How long? 10 seconds. Oh my god. Oh, that was five, guys. Three, two, one. Oh. 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 Nice. 10 seconds, guys. We go up a leg. God, I don't want a leg out. This is like driving. How, how do you not know? <laughs> Three. That one hurts. Two. This one. one. <laughs> Let's go. Hinge. Oh. 
really focused hip hinge guys back nice and straight keeping that slight bend whoop, in the knee on those rdls feel that stretch 20 to go Ooh. 10 more seconds Last five. Oh, now we're, now we're Three, going to keep talking. Two, one. Oh, my God. It's that last 10 seconds really kicks in. Yeah. Oh. Alternating rows, guys, or do one side, change halfway. Three, two, one. Let's go. Power. Core strong. Squeeze the glutes. Even though we're not moving, it's going to really support the lower back. Get a slight twist if you need to. Keep the back nice and strong. If you are feeling it too much in your lower back, just support and do one side and then change oh, halfway. These seem to take ages. Huh? These take ages, it seems longer. Last five seconds, guys. Come on, guys. Three, two, one. Oh. All right, good work, guys. Plank walkouts. And that's two sets done. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. Walk it out. Come back. Remember, tuck that pelvis. Tuck, 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 crunch, squeeze the glutes. See, I just bagged the rest there. You know what I was going to say? Look at how long you decide to focus on technique. <laughs> yeah. It's so important you do it correctly, guys, for me. I don't mind stopping. <laughs> I think you're going to need help on press ups. Next do you reckon? Time I think I'm fine. I think I'm going to check this for <laughs> 10 more seconds, guys. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Oh. Well done. Whew. Boom. Good job, guys. Last set. Right, Last Jenny. round. Heavier. Go for it. Here we go, guys. Last one. Three, yeah. two, one. Let's do it. It, guys focus good quality movement big hinge for the hips load up hamstrings and glutes 20 to go oh, 15 oh. last 10 seconds come on guys oh. glutes 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 hammies 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 three Two, one, oh, oh, God. my days. Eight seconds, guys. One and a half push her upper is in three, two, one. Let's be having you tuck the pelvis. Now, just make sure you've got your pelvis tucked here, <laughs> right under. Yeah, does it break you <laughs> nice right <laughs> Oh. You. Stop it! You're going faster! <laughs> 25 gone. 15 to go. Come on, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> Eight, seven, on, one more. six, five, four, three, one two, more. one. Nice. Oh, eight seconds, guys. Other leg. Oh. Three, two, one. Let's go. Find that rhythm. Back nice and straight. Really focusing on that hip hinge. 
Load up hammies, we <laughs> load up glutes. I like these, I think. Good. Yeah. 20 to go. Oh. Oh. Last 10. Last five, guys. Three, two, one. Oh, me poor glutes. Me poor glutes. Pray for the glutes. Eight seconds, guys. Alternating rows. Maybe go single and change halfway if you want. Three, two, one, go. Bend the legs a little bit. I know they're hurting, but they're gonna help you out a bit. 20 gone. Remember, single arm, change halfway if you wish. 15 to go. Oh guys, 10, 10 seconds. Straight. Oh. Uh. Three, two, one. Oh, oh man. Uh. Walk out and we're done. But not quite. There's still more. In three, two, one. Let's go. Tuck the pelvis. Crunch the abs. Squeeze the glutes. Take your feet a bit wider. If you want a bit more stability. Put them together, that'll make it harder. Single leg. Hang on. Oh yeah. Well done. Cool. I'll leave that to you. Oh heck. <laughs> Last 15 guys. Leg. Always crunching those abs. Always squeezing the glutes. We are. Five, four, three, two, and one. Oh, well done. Oh, want a drink? I enjoyed that. Oh. 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 Drink? Oh. 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 <laughs> Guys, awesome. 15 minutes to graft. But we ain't done yet, people. A little something, just a little something, something to finish up on. Bit of arms and abs now. Hey, we can give the legs a rest. Happy days. Right, guys, have a drink. This is where you find out what the towel's for. It wasn't just to wipe your brow. Arms and abs. Right, we're gonna power through this, guys. Right. Exercise number one, right, okay. Bloop, bloop. Rewind, three exercises, 50 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest between each, three rounds, nine minutes of work. Yeah, and then we'll wrap up, because we'll go over the hour otherwise. Uh, right, number one, push-ups, but close grip. It's gonna emphasize the triceps a little bit more. So, elbows in, or if you can, Go even closer still. Oh. <laughs> nice and close. Again, similar to the heels elevated squats, this is gonna create more flexion of the elbow, more triceps. Regression, knees to the floor. Go again, low as you can. Or regression further still, just reduce the range. So go down as low as you can and come back up. Those triceps are still working. Exercise number two, curls for the girls. Or well, the guys, what are you doing? You are? You're doing a dumbbell. Yes, yeah, so stand back here then, so we can see what you're doing. So you're going to feed the towel through the handle of the kettlebell. Okay, so grab it okay. like that. Right, guys, standing up nice and straight, nice strong posture. Starting with the elbows fully extended. Elbows fully extended, good. Shoulders back, squeeze the glutes, abs tight. From here we curl up. Whoa. and then back down. 
and again, wow, and back down. Nice, 50 seconds of that. So curling all the way up, full elbow extension at the bottom of every single rep. Then let's do a little trial run, because you don't want to get to the top of the movement and have a kettlebell slap you where it hurts. I went with, oh God. <laughs> if you've got a pair of dumbbells, you can obviously just curl with a dumbbell in each hand. If you've got one big dumbbell, you can just hold at the ends of the dumbbell and curl like so. Okay? Cool. Number three, just flying through these now. On your back, V sit ups. Big, big drive for the lower back, reaching up, always keeping that tension, regression, bend the arms, bend the legs. Sorry for the speedy one, trying to stick to time. So there it is, guys. Close push ups, 50 seconds, 10 seconds rest, curls, 50 seconds, 10 seconds rest, V sit ups, three rounds. We've got nine minutes of work here, then we're done. Let's go. Let's be having you. If you haven't got a towel at the ready, you can just kind of grab your kettlebell like this, actually, by the handles, if needs be. Right then, close grip push her up for us. Three, two, one, let's go. Working with the range you've got, guys. Fifteen gone. <laughs> Should make it 45 seconds. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna make this 45 seconds, guys. 20 to go in that case. Yay. It's funny what a difference it makes, isn't it? Yeah. 15 to go. 10 seconds. Come on, guys. Last five. Three, two, one. Oh. Where's that 24? Yeah. I've got to keep it real. Yeah. <laughs> Eight seconds, guys. Then we're into our curls. Three, two, one. Elbows nice and close to the body. Squeeze it up as high as you can. Try not to stop just short here. Keep the elbows fully extended at the bottom. So we know we're working for that nice big full range. High arms. Straight back. I should stand the other way, really. What? I should stand the other way. My right arm's my bigger arm. <laughs> 15 to go. Oh, what do you want? 16. Oh. Even that's hard, isn't it? I was going to say, I'm going to drop down next set. Yeah. Three, two, one. Oh man. You can talk a bit in between. <laughs> yeah. I'm definitely going lighter. Do you want the 20? V sit ups, guys. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Don't let the shoulders, head, arms, feet touch the floor. Always driving that lower back. Big crunch. Remember regression. Bend the arms. Bend the legs. 25 to go. Always keeping that tension on the abs, guys. 15 to go. Last eight seconds. Three, two, one. Oh. One done, two to go, guys. Let's power through. Oh, man. Do you want the 20? Yes, please. All right, guys, ready? Three, two, one. Close grips. Let's go. You can always take your hands a bit wider if it gets a little bit too spicy. <laughs> Pepperoni. Too okay. spicy for you. <laughs> 15 gone. 5 full. And then I'm dropping to knees. Oh my god. 20 to go. Come on. Last 10. Come on. 3 reps. Come on, 2 more. Come on, your knees, you sir. 
<laughs> Five seconds. Right. Three, two, one. Oh my god. Honourable. <laughs> I should have just been sat there. Come on. Come <laughs> <Back> on. <laughs> you wrap around. Right, guys, curls. Three, two, one. Let's go. Extend at the bottom guy. If you look at your bicep as it contracts, <laughs> admire it. <laughs> it just helps it. A little bit. <laughs> Come Tiny on. Guy. Come on, bicep, you can do it. You're on 16, yeah. Carries out, I'm getting out of gun, do I carry it? <laughs> 10 more seconds. On a weight ratio, maybe. As in <sighs> body weight ratio. <sighs> Three. Two, one. Oh my God. That's oh, so hard, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, but I like it. <laughs> I like it. Well, sit up. Oh, yeah. Oh, thank you, V ups. Three, two, one. Shh. Let's go, guys. Good boy, Jimmy. Oh, Good boy. Relax the arms as much as you can. Let them recover. Just one more round after this. Uh, Hallelujah. That'll be amazing. <sighs> 20 to go, guys. Remember, regress it if you need. I'll show you. <coughs> Bend hey, the arms. Hey, Bend the legs. Oh, God. 10 more seconds. Come on, mate, boy. You can do it. Come on. <sighs> Three, two, one. Oh. Making Hamish wine. He's, he has a, he's, he's right to be concerned. Eight seconds, guys. Close grip push ups. Three, oh. two, one. Let's go. Hamish, get in the way. Many as you can. I can't do it. Hamish is in the way. Oh, what a shame. <laughs> Ten gone. <laughs> Closing my eyes, going to my happy place. Oh my god. Tuck the pelvic. Clutch the ass. Squeeze the glutes. 15 to go. Ten, ten seconds, ten guys. Second. Five seconds. Three, two, four. Jesus. Oh. Mine got a bit messy towards the end there. You want to look at mine. What was it now, guys? Better bye. <laughs> we don't try. If you try to get by. <laughs> and, oh, let's go. <sighs> Come on. Fully extend the arms at the bottom, guys. <sighs> Who's crapped themselves in the nuts yet? <laughs> <laughs> Twenty gone. Oh. Jesus. Fifteen to go. Oh my god. What's that burn? Ten to go. Five, four, three, two, one. My god. Yay. Yay. Did that burn? For you. Yeah. Is that burning? Yeah, but. Jeez. Oh, last thing, guys, and we're done. Five, yeah. four, three, two, one. Let's go. F 45 seconds, guys, then we're done. Let's make this 50. Shut up, Paris. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Drive that lower back, guys. Keep that tension in the abs. Don't let the feet, shoulders, head, arms touch the floor. Regress if you need to. Jesus, it's taking forever. Come on. I can't see. 10 seconds. Come on. Three, two, one. Oh my God. There it is. 
Oh, well done. That was oh. oh man. Cool. Got a cheeky little pump on. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, wow. Big, big sesh today. Big workout. Massive props to everyone that stuck with us from start to finish. Big up anyone who's doing it later. Ooh. But you know what? Big up anyone who even gave it a bash. Even if you did part of it, it's something, right? Big love to you all. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for joining us. What's tomorrow? For all our workouts. Tomorrow, <laughs> we're gonna be doing a live workout in our Fit365 members group. What time? Eight o'clock. Eight o'clock. So Bright and breezy. Getting it done. Making room for them Easter eggs. <laughs> so remember guys, Fit365, 30 day full access, free trial right now. Fit365.com, check it out. Loads of awesome content there, lots of helpful resources. No obligation whatsoever to stick around, but we'd love to have you, even if it is for the 30 days. Check it out, guys. Get in the Facebook group. Join us tomorrow morning. Big love to every bye single bye. one of you. Have a great day, guys. Enjoy your Easter Saturday. See ya. Bye-bye.